Misplaying this game so that's why I ordered it and now I have it. I'm gonna end up beating the game in one day haha. Ha. I never used to enjoy first person shooters until I got Ghost Recon at some point I bought Call of Duty 1 and enjoyed the heck out of that it felt like I was in a World War 2 movie I didn't get any of the other versions until I got this one had a few glitches running it on my PC but getting more memory helped in that regard and I am amazed by this game I don't particularly care for the linear storyline but it works the thing that really blew me away was the nuke that goes off in about the middle of the game the spinning of the helicopter as it crashes and then the brief looking up to see the mushroom cloud that is one experience I hope I never see in real life. The incredible realism between the way the gun fires to how the bullets react with the scenery made this my favorite so far. I haven't even tried playing online yet but in single player mode, I'm more than content. Men of war scenarios are depicted including typical infantry, cover type operations, sniper, and even gunner in a helicopter as well as my favorite. Gunner in a AC-130 gunship with images and sounds that are just like videos from the news or online. And the enemy, very smart and hard to fight with grenade throwbacks, precise shooting, and even wounded, able to lie on the ground and fire their pistol at you. I highly recommend this to anyone who loves first shooter games. This is one of my most played games of all time. I played it a lot, too much, probably, when it first came out and I still fire it up every now and then. I bought MW2 hoping, dearly, that it would be better than COD4, but it isn't. COD4 can still hold its own against almost any first person shooter out there after 3 years of owning and playing this game. I can confidently say it's a 5 star product.